Hey all you folks out there in noisy rock guitar land, um, if you want to record noisy rock guitar at home, like me, uh, you might need one of these. It's a ISO box I built into a closet in my home uh, that I can put speaker cabinets in for uh, recording guitar. So uh, down here you can see I put jacks for uh, one speaker cable to run in there and two mic cables. So I just run those all the way over to my studio area, which has heads and stuff and my mic pre's and all that stuff. Um, I built the box as big as possible. It's about three feet by three feet by 30 inches high. And uh, I did that uh, because I believe the, the largest amount of space possible inside the box will create the best sound, the least sort of boxy character. So I had to actually build it into the corner, um, uh, put it all together using some wood glue and L brackets. And so lifting up the lid, you can see on the inside I've got weather stripping all the way around the, the edge. And I've lined the whole inside with uh, stuff that's called 703. Uh, it's mineral fiber um, and it's insulation. Covered it in burlap and attached the burlap to the, the mineral fiber stuff using uh, some 3M spray adhesive. And I got all that stuff from a place called ATS Acoustics. And it was really reasonable, uh, reasonable prices. So I recommend them. I've attached some of the 703 to the top here as well. And I got some Oralex in there and other stuff. I'm just kind of experimenting with different levels of deadening inside the, uh, the box. So you can see the cables coming out from the corner there for the speaker and the mic uh, cables. I go into a, a, a 57 and a Sennheiser 421 that I've got on a Bogner 112 cabinet. Um, it's big enough in there to fit a 212 for sure. So I made it, made it pretty big. And uh, that's it, pretty much. It works really well. Um, I've got one adjoining wall in this place that I'm living in. And uh, there's still um, a fair amount of low-end transfer to the floor if you're really cranking it up loud. But I went over to the neighbors with a guitar and a wireless unit today and played some guitar, and you can barely hear it over there. And they weren't bothered by it at all. So I think this whole thing was a success. It sounds really good. Um, and uh, that's it. So I'm going to be using this to cut tracks, finish up, finishing up my new album. And uh, if you hear me doing any clips or anything online, or lessons or whatever, I'll be cutting them all using this box. So uh, that's it. All right. See ya.